and I will say it to you in Hebrew, the language of the Prophet, and then I will translate for you in Polish. And he voted Ezekiel 37. The dry bones. The prophecy of Yechezkel Anavi הייתה על היד השם ויניחני בתוך הבקעה והיא מלאה עצמות והנה רבות מאוד על פני הבקעה והנה יבשות מאוד. The hand of the Lord was upon me, he brought me to a valley, the valley was full of his bones, very many bones, dry bones. And then the Lord asked me, בן אדם, מנש, התחיינה העצמות האלה? Do they have a chance to live these dry bones? And the Prophet answered, Hashem Elohim, God in heaven, Ataya Data, only you know the answer. I don't know. Then a wind blew, and the wind brought all the bones one to the other, and they became corpses, legs, arms, heads, corpses, but with no spirit of life, dead corpses. And then he asked me again, Now answer to me, do they have a chance to live? Resurrection? I said, Only you know. Another wind came stronger in, inside of each of these corpses, and they stood up of their legs, a great great battalion of living people. And then the Almighty said to the Prophet, these dry bones are the symbol for the Jewish nation. I know what they say. Yavshu atzmatayim. Our bones are dry. Avda tikvatayim. We lost hope. Nigzar nunanu. We are cut off, disconnected from life. So I tell you, you have a mistake. I will open your graves. I will take you out, up of your graves, O oh my people. And I will bring you to the land of Israel. Aaron finished his talk and said, 